Happy mid-November, monkeys! I've recently gotten into playing around with the uh, Free Nova Ultimate Starter Kit for the Raspberry Pi, which basically allows you to do some control through the GPIO of the Raspberry Pi through using code like Python or C++, I guess, if you really wanted to. Um, but I've also discovered it makes a mess, and there's stuff everywhere, and it's also hard to remove components without moving absolutely everything. Um, so with that, I printed myself out a nice breadboard tray that holds the Raspberry Pi and the breadboard itself. So this is fresh off the printer. I really actually like this color a lot. Just so you guys know, it's a CC3D silk shiny red PLA. Uh, looks really good, prints really well, and I love the pattern of the infill th showing through. So let's get it all taken care of as far as the supports go and get those out of there. There's some, just some little notches in here that hold this breadboard in place. Get that out. See if we can carefully get these ones out without breaking anything. Nice, that one came right out. Do this one over here. Same thing. Some fringe off that, and then one more here. the hole so you can get the SD card out. Alright, let's see if it fits in here. Slide it in so the notches on the back side line up with the holes. And let's see if the pie slides in just how I wanted it to. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Look at that. Holds it. No falling out. Can grab components out without the breadboard moving around. Absolutely great. You can still get to the card, all the ports that you need, and all the ports back there. That should work out great. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day. Bonus that I should mention, STL down in the description if you want it.